Hi, today we'll be taking a look at the new Aquaforce from Vanguard VPT11 featuring um not sure whether Tavas or Lambros. Right, okay, let's go for Tavas. Alright, so there's our new grade tree. So we have Tavas, the first skill, Vanguard and Rearguard skill. Activate once per turn, rest one rear guard, and choose up to an opponent's rear guard, retire it. Next as a Vanguard. At the start of your battle phase, if you have three or more rested rear guards, discard one card from hand. From your deck, search for up to one grade four, ride it. In stand, shuffle the deck. During this turn, that unit get power plus ten thousand, drive plus one, and at the end of the turn, retire that unit, and from your soul, ride a grade three in rest. So you get two XL circle in one turn. So that's our new Tavas. So for grade 4, we actually have Lambros, which is the VR. So when it's on hand, if you have Vanguard with Tavas in name, this card get grade minus 1. So it can be called as a grade 3. When it enters the Vanguard circle, stand any amount of your rear guard. When it attacks, counter blast 1, so blast 1. Choose one column. Stand all your rear guard in that same column. If your opponent is grade three and above during this turn, each of that unit the uh, rear guard get power plus five thousand. Right, so you get an additional ten k in that column. Right, for the grade three, we actually uh, was thinking of having rip tight in the deck for the additional finisher of a thirty two k. Right, but uh, we have quite. Uh, space constraint, so this got, this got removed. But you can always play one copy or two copy of your deck, right? So let's go for the great tools. So first of all, we have coral assault. After, during attacking battle, if you have four or more rested unit, this unit get power plus fifteen k. And at the end of turn, if you attack four more times, send this into soul to draw one. Right, this is a four copy. Next, a new addition to the Aqua Force, which can be played in, I would say, almost any build. So we have Dennis, copywriter Dennis. Activate as a bank out rear guard. Rest one of your other rear guard. Look at the top of your deck, call it on the rear guard circle. And ability of the card with the same name can only activate once per turn. Right, so we have a uh, pseudo royal paladin or go paladin. Next, Arceus activate as a rear guard once per turn. Counter plus one, rest two rear guard. During this turn, this unit get power plus 10,000. Alright, the reason we play this is we try to have as many units with the ability to rest others or rest itself. So this went into attack. The other great tool that was in consideration was actually the Terrific Koi uh, Dragon. So as a rear guard once per turn, when this card gets standby uh, ability during this turn, this unit get power plus 5000. So by standing by card ability, it becomes 14k. When attacking, and this is the first battle, so plus one to withstand this unit. Right, this was around two copies in the deck. Right, it's good to have, but we try to prioritize in the amount of ability that rests. So once this is stabilized, we maybe add one or two copies into the deck. So that's for the grade two. For grade one, it's pretty simple. So first of all, we have uh, the Good Tree Searcher, which will be reprinted in BT11. Next, we have Nikki. When it enters a uh, Vanguard Circle, look at top 7. Review up to 1 Savas or Dennis. Add it to a hand, shuffle the deck. And as a rear guard, rest this unit. Return one normal unit from your drop zone back to bottom deck to Soul Charge 1. Alright, the main thing is to return the unit back to bottom deck and to rest this unit. This is to recycle the amount of uh, Lambros we have. Next, we have the Penguin Soldier. 
for two effect. One is to rest it to give the unit power plus five thousand, since you can stand it at the attack phase, so that unit get a free five thousand, and you get to rest this unit to reach the count of three. And not only that, uh, in desperate situation, you can actually send retire it to counter charge one if needed. So uh, it's two use, so definitely four copies. Next we have uh, Nerissa, when stand by uh, when rested by other cards ability, so plus one, stand it and you get power plus 10,000. At the end of the battle, if you have four more rested units, send to soul to draw one. Right, it was four copy, we cut it to two, so since we don't have a lot of situation where we need to restand her with the soul plus one, right, but it's still a good to have. The other great one that was in consideration was actually uh, the Frontal Sailor. It's a common from EB12. When it get restand in the front row, during this turn, this unit get power plus 10,000. It's not once per turn, so you get to stack 17k, 27k. Right, so uh, it's also a interesting uh, potential unit for this deck. For triggers, we are playing 6 draw, 6 crit. Right, uh, you can actually go for a 5 draw if you're comfortable with that, but since we need a lot of puzzle pieces, so I recommend a 6 draw. Alright, uh, as for the grade 4, we are playing 4 copies purely for the reason that Shiranui exists. Okay, because um, previously when we are playing with 3, right, we actually hit a situation where uh, Lambros got bind. By Shiranui's effect, and we do not have enough puzzle pieces to uh, strike. So, right now we're going for four for safety reason. Anyway, it can be caught as a rear guard as a great tree, anyway. So, uh, no harm playing four. Alright, let's do the usual. Alright, so first we write Tavas to have an Excel 2. You can actually go for Excel 1 if you want. Uh, it's up to the player. So we get to draw 1. So ideally we have uh, Dennis on the field. Right, this is for the usual game. And we have, uh, let's say, uh, Nikki on the field. Right, so we rest one of them. Look at top, call out one unit. So ideally we get to call attacker or a booster. Or a sword. Or we may have Akios. So the idea is to rest three unit. So with Dennis we already rested one. Tavas we can rest another unit. Just to um, destroy our opponent's rear guard. Then Akios, rest two rear guard, any of them to give you power plus 10,000. Right, so once we have three, uh, when we go to uh, more than three, we, when we go to attack phase, we can actually do this. Or before that, since uh, we already counted, we confirm have three, we can so plus one to restand this to give you a power plus 10,000 if needed. Alright, so it depends on situation. If you are confident that you have. 3 rested unit, you can actually pay the cost to restand her. If you're not sure, best to leave it as a rest for the even though we have lesser 10k, at least the deck will be functioning. Alright, so discard one card, strike power plus 10,000, drive plus one, and we get to stand all our rear guards. So ideally, we will attack with this first. Then effect when this unit attacks, pay the cost, stand one column. Right, and we get to triple check. And we continue like that. Right, so for other combos, we actually have things such as uh, having Penguin Soldier here beforehand, rest to give the power plus 5000, rest two other units to give 10,000 so this column will be very big so when you attack this is like your main column of attacking 
and after that we have another 15k if we have four rested unit here right so potentially we will have uh, one two three four five attack on our first right into grade three right so this is our new lambros uh, it's very tactical and you do need to plan beforehand which you need to rest and which one not to rest so example if we do not have enough fuel guard resting two you need to get the 10,000 compared to having penguin rested to give the 5,000 is more worth it so you need to have some planning and when desperate you can actually just call your let's say your trigger onto the field just to rest one for them uh, for with Tava's effect to get the three unit so at any point of time before you go into battle phase you must make sure they have three rested unit and since this is activated skill once per turn actually it's not once per turn activate the skill you try to push Lampros back to your deck as frequent as possible in case it get bind by any other card effect so this is definitely a must play right so this is for Lampros and Tavas from BT11